Late this morning, the Department of Administration met with the Attorney General's office and other officials to respond to Attorney Mike Phillips' 12 noon deadline on issuing out cost of living allowance certificates. Assistant Attorney General Pat Mason says the meeting went well and DOA plans to comply with the law. I think our meeting was good. I met with DOA. I advised Mr. Phillips that I was going to meet with DOA. And so I'll be calling Mr. Phillips and we're hoping to work this out and have it taken care of very soon. Soon after, Phillips says he received a call from Mason telling him their decision. When, you know, While he feels good COLA certificates will be issued soon, he mentions that COLA class members that, weren't asking uh, for an immediate payment to just to guarantee the certificates the will be that, done. Uh, you know, we had reached an agreement and they'll be working with the retirement fund and of course with uh, DOA to make that happen. And, uh, you know, I stress the, the importance of uh, receiving immediate credit. And, uh, you know, we can wait uh, a short while for the actual certificate, but uh, the class members have to know today that, okay, you guys, um, we've prevailed and, and you're going to receive um, the credit. According to Phillips, the crediting of individual accounts belonging to COLA class members should happen immediately by the Government of Guam Retirement Fund. From there, it's all a matter of DOA contracting out the task of printing the certificates. He also says the certificates are accruing a 6% interest rate, like the promissory notes that were issued out a couple of years ago. Though he reflects on the reality that not every single member of the COLA class is here today, he just hopes everyone can move on and that there is justice. I'm, I'm grateful that um, the administration's decided to uh, honor the statute and, uh, you know, they will in time make that payment. And uh, my understanding from their representations is they're going to immediately make or um, uh, going to credit the accounts. And, and so I think we can move on from here and, and hopefully this is, you know, the end.